वेलकम एवरी वन एज यू ऑल नो माई चैनल फास्ट एंड ईजी मैथ्स इज क्रिएटेड विद एन इंटेंट ऑफ गिविंग यू ट्रिक्स एंड ट्रिप्स रिलेटेड टू मैथ्स सो इफ यू ऑल लाइक दीज वीडियोज देन यू कैन प्लीज लाइक एंड सब्सक्राइब टू माई चैनल ऑल्सो यू कैन हिट द बेल बटन बिसाइड इट सो दैट यू कैन गेट नोटिफाइड वेन एवर आई पोस्ट अ न्यू वीडियो सो लेट एस बिगिन विद आर वीडियो वेर आई एम गोट टू शो यू अ ट्रिक विथ विच यू विल बी एबल टू नो द प्राइम नंबर्स फ्रॉम वन टू हंड्रेड इन मैटर ऑफ सेकेंड but before that let's just quickly revise what is a prime number a prime number is a number which gets divided only by itself or 1 so let's take the few numbers 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 so on so now over here can we say that 2 gets divided by any other number except 1 and itself yes so that is my prime number also can we say that 3 also gets divided only by itself or by 1 yes correct so here that is also my prime number but for 4 we can say that 4 can get divided by 2 and it can divide get, get divided by 1 also it can get divided by itself but the definition of prime number is only those numbers which can get divided by itself or one can be considered as prime numbers so over here four can't be considered as prime numbers moving on can i say five also gets divided by itself and one only so here five also is considered as a prime number but for six can i say number six gets divided by one it gets divided by 2 it also gets divided by 3 and it also gets divided by itself so here number 6 also does not fit into the definition of prime numbers so 6 is also not a prime number and for 7 we know that 7 also gets divided only by 1 or itself so 7 is also a prime number but now this is very easy 2 3 5 7 11 we know few prime numbers up to 20 but remembering the prime numbers from 1 to 100 is a bit difficult so let us see how we can do that also before beginning with that i would like to tell you all that the prime number series starts from 2 it does not start from 1 because in maths we take 1 as neither prime nor composite okay so let's begin so as you all know that we are going to find prime numbers from 1 to 100 so over here i have written all the numbers from 1 to 100 now please pay attention i have written numbers from 1 to 6 in the horizontal rows and then i have continued writing them up to 100 now as we all know we need to find the prime numbers we know that numbers 2 3 and 5 are my prime numbers and since we know that any number which is multiple of 2 will not be a prime number so over here we can say that 4 won't be a prime number as well as 6 won't be a prime number now in order to find the prime numbers we are going to simply cancel out all the multiples of 2 4 and 6 meaning if i look at this particular column all the numbers are multiple of 2 so i'm simply going to cancel out all of these numbers similarly here also in this particular column all the numbers are multiple of 2 so i'm going to strike out this column as well and if we look over here all these numbers are also multiple of 2 so i'm going to cancel out this column also now let's look at this column the column which is below 3 we can say all these numbers are multiples of 3 and since a prime number is a number which can be divided by itself or only one so we can say that these numbers are divided by 3 hence i'm going to strike out this column as well now your entire task has become very easy because in order to find the prime numbers you just have to concentrate on column number 1 and column number 5 now 
as we know that multiples of 5 will also get striked out because these won't be prime numbers. So, let's look at this diagonally. We know that 10, 15, 20 and 25 are multiples of 5. So, we are going to strike this line diagonally. And after 25, the multiple of 5 is 30. So, let's look, look at this diagonally again. 30, 35, 40, 45, 50 and 55. So, I am going to strike this line diagonally again. After 55, the multiple of 5 is 60. After 60, it is 65, 70, 75, 80 and 85. So, again we are going to strike this out diagonally. And after 85, the multiple of 5 is 90, 95 and 100. So, we are going to strike this out diagonally. And we also know that 7 is a prime number. So, multiples of 7 will also get cancelled. That means 7 2s are 14, 3s are 21, 4s are 28, 5s are 35 and 6s are 42. So, I am going to strike this line diagonally again. And then we know after 42 the next multiple of 7 is 49. So, then 56, 63, 70, 77 and 84. So, again I am going to strike this out diagonally and after 84 the next multiple of 7 is, 7 is 91 and 98 so I am going to strike this out again diagonally. Now you all will see the numbers which are left over are nothing but prime numbers up to 100. If you want to cross verify let's check the next prime number is 11 and 11 2's are 22 that is striked off 11 3's are 33 that is also striked off 11 4's are 44 that is again striked off 11 5's are 55 11 6's are 66 11 7's are 77 11 8's are 88 11 9's are 99 we're seeing that all the multiples of 11 are already striked off so now as we know that the multiples of 11 are already taken away from the rest of the numbers then we don't need to check for 13 17 19 and so on Students, this trick will be very very beneficial when it comes to dividing big numbers. And if you have liked this video, then you can please like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.